What's up, everybody? It's John with John Sports Arts and Collectibles coming at you with a brand new video. I can't believe it. <laughs> I can't believe it. And what is it? It is that I actually spoke with someone at Panini today about this redemption, which you can see right here, and I've covered up the code. A redemption for a Damian Lillard autographed 2019-20 uh, Donruss basketball signature series card that I've been extremely vocal about on the channel here for, for you know, going back years. And we're going to show you the video where I actually pulled it. And I was part of the class action lawsuit that was thrown out. By a judge who I don't know how that even happened. We all know the story of Panini and they're they're fulfilling redemptions. And I've been, like I said, I've been extremely vocal about it since this happened to me. I've not opened their product up really here on the channel at all. It's kind of the I like to say banned on the channel, but really it's my choice of purchasing whatever I want to purchase to showcase here. But I just don't open up the product anymore. And it's primarily because of this situation that happened to me. So let me tell you what happened today. So I drive to the post office to mail out some items that, that were sold on our eBay store and was heading home, stopped off at the grocery store to get a couple of things. And I was in the car thinking about this situation here. And, and, and it's been a long time. around four years almost, that this was this was fulfilled. And I said, well, you know what? I'm not really making card content on the channel anymore. You know, I, I stay before I'll come back in a few weeks, probably with something for you guys. I know that there are a lot of people who are disappointed. I think I was stepping away from this altogether. I'm not. I just want to take a break from all that stuff. Um, but I thought, well, you know, I, I, I like to make these kind of videos where I, you know, give my opinions about things. And not everybody likes them. So I thought, well, maybe I should cover this because I, I have it's been a while since I really talked about it in this kind of fashion. And I opened this up on the website, which is the ticket for this. And the story is with this is that I had I had um put this redemption in literally the day of or the next day that I opened up this product. And I'm gonna show you that in a second. It's kind of wild. Um and then nothing happened and the pandemic happened and I thought well maybe there was a delay with it from that and I've seen other Donruss or Panini products with his you know from that this year that he signed so I don't know what happened here I don't know but it was never fulfilled and so you know months go by a year goes by and I think I asked for like points and then nothing was happening there. I would call, I would just get a voicemail. I'd leave message after message after message. I would send emails out. I would get no response. Then I joined the class action lawsuit with, I don't know how many people were on that. A lot of people were involved in that thing. And they all got thrown out. And I thought, well, this is never going to get fulfilled. And then the attorney for that represented everybody that was in the class action lawsuit contacted me. Oh, it's been at least a month or so, asking me, you know, that they or telling me that they were going to try to approach Panini and uh, see about getting some sort of monetary compensation, if not a, a you know, if not the card or something. And so I was working with them on how much I figured the card was worth raw. It's roughly you know about two three hundred bucks somewhere in there, raw and you know graded if it comes back a high grade could be worth a lot more and so that was just left where it was I have not heard from that attorney or that office since I spoke to them and emailed them so today like I said I was heading home stopped over the grocery store to get a couple things was in the car thinking about st things that I'm working on but also you know can I come up with some sort of content to keep you know showing on the channel here before I start 
maybe opening a product again. And I said, well, let me look into this again. And so I just went on the website and I'm like, you know what? I'm going to call and see if I can actually get through some get through somebody. And if I don't get through somebody, I can talk about that in the video too. Well, I actually got, they actually answered the phone. There's a special number to call if you have questions about your redemptions and whatnot. And they actually answered the phone. Very polite young man answers the phone. I was shocked. I couldn't believe it. I told him that. I'm like, I can't believe I'm actually talking to a human being. I've been trying to get this thing resolved now. And he asked for the ticket number. Put the ticket number in and... As I was explaining what was going on, he was like, no, this, 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 this is, this should have been taken care of a long time ago. So apparently they are going to send me something of equal value or higher. And I should be getting a confirmation email from them shortly. And I asked him, well, what is this that I'm going to be getting? And he said, it's going to be something good. So here's the also the original redemption, too, that I pulled. And we're going to watch this video now. So let me just clip over here. Let's take this off gently. So here it is. This, is the, this video was made, um, God, it's only got 735 views. Let's see if it has a date on here. There's no, oh, yeah, April 29, 2020. This video was made. So it'll be four years this April in a few months that I pulled this redemption out of this box. And here we go. I was using top man. I don't know if it's deeper in or if it's going to be in the middle here or where we're going to find out soon. Devin Booker. Chris Middleton. Here is, what is this? Ooh, a redemption. Sanchez series, Damian Lillard. That's nice. All right, we get the redemption. We will take that. That's awesome. Sanchez series card, Damian Lillard. We got to scratch this off. We got to uh, go on their website and we got to pull that. That's awesome. That's right on of the hip bell over here. Ding a ding ding a ding a ding. <laughs> so there you go. That's when I actually pulled that redemption, which is again right here. Um, and let's see what happens. I am really curious to see what they send me. I hope it's not, you know, I hope that they are, they stick to their word. That's all I have to say. This still doesn't excuse them for what happened because the, for going out, you know, April of 2024 will be four years. That to me is insanely just, just extremely unprofessional. I mean, it shows how much they care about the customers. They don't really care if they're going to let something like that go that long. And that ticket's been open. And I made multiple changes to it for the last, you know, three, almost four years. So I, it's not going to change my opinion about opening up their product on the channel here. It's just a shame because I do like, you know, as much as the, NBA gets a bad rap with certain things that players do. I still do like basketball products and, and I like football products too. And I've not opened up those things. It's been very, you know, very rare that you'll see that kind of product open up on the channel here. Um, and I don't know if that's going to change. I, I really don't like, you know, want to give any of these companies my money that, anymore, but, uh, Let's see what happens. When it arrives, I will make a video and we will I will open it in a video and we'll see what they send me. Hopefully, like I said, they'll stick to their word and send me something of equal or greater value. So you're looking at at least a car that's worth at least $200 raw auto. They did ask me my favorite team. I said, I don't really have one. I do, but I'm not going to pigeonhole myself with a specific team. And then I get nobody of any, of any note. So we will see. I wanted to share this with everybody. 
uh, kind of a shocker in a sense to me personally, uh, making a phone call on a whim just to see. I was actually expecting to get another voicemail and then to be talking about this and doing a lot of yelling <laughs> as, as, I, as, I, as, my, as, as, as my memory gets, gets, uh, gets refreshed here of, of, of the situation. Um, so anyway, I just wanted to share this with everybody. Let's see what they send me. I imagine if I get this email in the next day or so that I will probably get this item. I would expect by the end of the week, early next week. And uh, so look out for a video on that. And that's really all I have for now. And again, I appreciate you guys stopping by and watching this one. And we'll see what happens. Remember to like, subscribe, comment down below, and share this video with your friends, family, and loved ones. And the eBay store link is down below in the description. And that's all I've got for you guys. Till next time, folks. This is John with John Sports Arts and Collectibles signing off. And hey, I'll see you all soon. Thank you.